Hey Spirit Boosters, how you guys doing? It's Janita, back again with another video, trying to get this quota. Can't do me, I just got calm. So anyway, I'm through with that. Now y'all can see what's on my um, screen here. I'm sharing with y'all some new stuff. Well, not everything not new, but some things are. But anyway, I got, y'all see what I got up here. But um, let me share with y'all this. Yes, some more recalls. I didn't. I, I didn't come across. They just on my dang um, searching engine. So what I seen today has to do with infant stuff. Now this company, y'all got to Google this because some of these names strange. I've never heard of it, but it has something to do with some infant probiotic. Something you give infants probiotic. Some infant. Some kind of infant formula probiotic. And the company says they recalling it. Because it might have listeria, I, I think it was allegedly. You guys got to look it up. And I also already told y'all about the salad, the Doyle salad. Then I don't think I mentioned, but Kroger, I think they had Kroger ready to eat salad too. I ain't think about eating no salad now. So I, I don't know. It's just crazy. Is food being sabotaged or what? What y'all think? Leave it in the comments. Do y'all believe things are being sabotaged? Is this regular that you get this many uh, recalls in at one time? Hold up, y'all. I got to turn this fan off. Hold up. Okay, guys. Yeah. But anyway, if y'all think that's normal or you know different, you know better, you know better, just leave it in the comments section. Let us know what the hell is going on. Excuse me. Um, what else I got to say? Oh, I was on the YouTube looking at I know I got some some comments in the comment section that I need to respond to. And you know I will get to that as I will get to that as soon as possible. But anyway, let me tell y'all this from my sources <laughs> oh but anyway let me say this first i was watching this channel called i allege and the man was saying it's gonna be some allegedly food rationing going on so what the heck food rationing food short supply shortages the folks talking about that china thing that uh uh should i say um I'm trying to say uh the stock just everybody just saying the warning signs the the alarms the alerts the taking heed you got to get out there and get what you're gonna get I even read on a um an article where they saying Walmart is not gonna be open this year for Thanksgiving so they saying you better get what you need now and then my source I I, <laughs> I call him my, my source says that at Sam's Club, some of those Sam's Club, they got the food sitting in the trailer and it can't get out because they don't have enough employees to work to do it. A lot of employees are quitting because it's just so much stress on them. It's not enough people to help out in some areas. Allegedly, all this going on, people fussing and fighting over food and all these going to be, it's supposedly going to be more food limitations and, uh, it's just going to be a, a mess. And if you guys um, don't uh, take heat, you're going to be left out and you're going to be left without. And don't come over here complaining on my channel with that negative attitude, that BS, telling my you got all the food. And if I do, what's it to you? Because if I, if you was in the neighborhood, yeah, I'll give you a, a I don't know. Because nowadays, everything is not safe. I would take the food to a... I, the way I donate, I'll take it to a pantry or uh, I'll do a food drive. I wouldn't just hand nobody nothing out of my house or nothing like that. Mm -mm, mm -mm. But uh, stop talking about what somebody else have and go try and get what you need. Because nowadays, it's hardly anything to get. Some stores do have a lot of stuff, but they saying it's getting so bad. Eventually, if these um, um truckers even they say it's really if they did hire a bunch of truckers i think i heard that on the news it don't even matter if they did hire a bunch of truckers um it still ain't gonna be enough people to move all the supplies they need moving 
and lucky in our area now even though my husband always saying they always putting some more on the shelf because people have came into the store and cleaned the shelf so it is happening over here but they do have some you know to put back on the shelf they can't everything not back on the shelf but it's whatever we regularly use is available and if it's not we just eat something else you see i got this glory over here <laughs> oh my god but anyway what's the other recall i told you guys i told you about the cakes the salami they're still talking about the onions i don't know it's a lot it's a lot and some it was some medicine too some some old strange name i don't know y'all just gotta google stuff y'all gotta do y'all research i know some of y'all might be depending on me to share a lot of this i don't mind doing it but when i do say it you have to look it up because it's in certain areas more in one and more in one area than others so that's why you gotta look it up see if it's in your store because they mentioned when dixie uh what the other store name not food line what's that other store do it start with a p public maybe public uh allegedly these stores walmart and stuff like that and and uh yeah so y'all gotta do y'all re research because it's a lot going on take heed to the warning signs start um something it's been going on for a while so the late the late the left out and without folks i don't know y'all better stay prayed up because hey I did my job and I just organized this stuff now because the end is full and I have to organize my stuff. I'll be I'll come in here and I hear any news, share my goings on and what happens and let y'all see what I have and see what I'm doing and all like that. But like I said, our store shopping or Jesus just be weekly, you know, some we ran out that we usually just use often we will be picking up from the store but yeah you guys do what you need to be doing don't procrastinate get off your ass get to the store get you something and then i feel i i don't know i'm glad i got a turkey but now afterwards i got that turkey now i see it's a lot of sales on the turkeys a lot of y'all talking about all these got turkeys 69 cents a pound I see Smart and Final. I don't know if everybody got a Smart and Final, but there's a 99 cents a pound. I don't know why the, the store, food for less, turkeys were so high when it's food for less. How is food for less going to let all these and the rest of these stores outdo them and have uh, cheaper turkeys than food for less? It's supposed to be food for less, food for less. <laughs> so I don't know what that's going on. Maybe maybe they got what they got and they ain't getting no more maybe those turkeys they have in food for less is all they have and they trying to make their money everybody else i don't know how many turkeys all of these before they gonna run out before they sell out but folks that got like nine ten freezers stocking up because i know i would be because i know i'm definitely gonna try and get me another turkey because i i would want one piece of at least a half of it for thanks not thanksgiving or uh, christmas or something i like turkey but anyway, no, oh, let me tell y'all what I got up here. I'm up here going on in, not even sharing the food up here. This is my little online haul. I told y'all I was missing Albert. There go Albert in the little dressing. I got the Pepperidge Farm, herb season classic stuffing, stuffing white and wheat bread blended with herbs and spices. And it's going to be mixed with some cornbread. And I got me a little, another box of the Idaho buttery home style mashed potatoes. Now, let me, I, let me tell you guys something. The last box I got of some mashed potatoes was much bigger than this box right here. I looked at that box and said, why is this box so little? Unless it's next to the, no, I think that box is smaller. I don't know. But it looks smaller to me. And then, I don't know if y'all remember, I had the Honest Earth. Home style mashed sweet potatoes. I got to try that out. I haven't used it yet. And then that slow cooker variety pack. I'm still waiting on Sam's Club to restock that. That haven't been restocked in a year. So that's what I'm talking about. There's a lot of stuff. Never, it's not going to come back. Not never, but it's going to be a while before it get back. Because a lot of stuff also is not being, it's not available because they don't have nobody to make it. Like I tell y'all. 
the glass they saying it's a bottle shortage can shortage egg sh it's shortages everywhere it's just a it's just crazy the, all these shortages all these recalls now they talking about rationing the food out this is the united states of america why we got to ration out some food well you know the weather's destroyed the crops the animals all jacked up they around there limping falling down half dead mm. the chickens you know they smaller so they really completely gone so that's why it's probably going to egg shortage because not enough chickens around poor animals now the humans acting silly they're blaming other humans for not having food because they procrastinate wait till the last minute and cry well let me well, I get some food you got all the food over there Honey child, you might not even live in my state up here blaming me and I'm way in California. You probably in the Carolinas somewhere. <laughs> Texas, somewhere else. In the Midwest, up north, anywhere but here. And you gonna blame me for having food. That you Come on now. Come on. But anyway, I'm just coming through, hollering at y'all. Just, you know, take heed. Get ready. Can't say it enough. I know a lot of you guys... Oh, spirit boosters on my channel have prepared are staying stocked up still stocking up know what's going on that's why i say over here on this in this community share your information what store got what and so forth and so forth and everybody will be happy and oh let me welcome any new subscribers and that's another thing i'm getting i, I got some new subscribers you guys quite a few new subscribers hey you guys y'all must do spirit boosters don't forget new spirit boosters share your what's going zones and what's happening thoughts views share some love get some tips ideas let us know what's going on in your area don't be shy make yourself known now be getting that comment section and don't be don't be don't be um don't be bothered about anything because any non-spirit boosters they go in the where they go in the where the screw you janita section right down there y'all y'all see that little box down there the non-spirit boosters they see <laughs> oh one last thing the tip do not do not if you can help it come on my channel insult me compliment me at the same time and then abandon me permanently and on that note Later, y'all.